As I slowly regained consciousness, I could feel the gentle strokes of a brush across my face. I blinked, adjusting to the bright lights of the salon. Sitting in a plush chair, I glanced at the reflection in the mirror in front of me, almost not recognizing myself. Becky, a skilled makeup artist, stood by my side, meticulously working on my makeover. You're doing great, Jack, she said with a reassuring smile. Mistress will be so pleased with the results. I shifted slightly in my seat, feeling the unfamiliar tug of the clothes against my skin. The lacy white blouse and dark skirt I was wearing were a far cry from my usual attire, but this was all part of the transformation Mistress had planned for me. Mistress had a particular affinity for sissies, and today was the day I would be fully transformed to meet her preferences. Becky continued to apply makeup, her touch light but deliberate. Mistress mentioned she prefers her slaves as females, Becky explained. Once I'm done here, you'll have an appointment with the doctor to start your hormone injections. The words hung in the air, adding a sense of finality to the process. I had known this was coming, had even prepared myself for it, but hearing it said out loud made it all the more real. I swallowed hard, nodding slightly as Becky finished up the last touches of my makeup. There, she said, stepping back to admire her work. You look beautiful, Jack. I looked at my reflection, seeing a pretty, almost passable young woman staring back at me. The transformation was remarkable, and I couldn't help but feel a mix of emotions, apprehension, excitement, and a strange sense of acceptance. Thank you, Becky, I said softly, my voice barely above a whisper. Becky smiled warmly, her eyes full of encouragement. Let's get you ready for your appointment. Mistress will be here soon, and I can't wait to see her reaction. As I stood up from the chair, I felt a sense of determination wash over me. This was my new reality, and I was ready to embrace it, knowing that it would please Mistress and bring me closer to the role she had envisioned for me. As Becky led me out of the salon and towards the waiting room, I couldn't help but feel a mix of anticipation and nervousness. My heart raced as I saw Mistress waiting for me, her eyes lighting up with approval as she took in my transformed appearance. Jackie, my sweet sissy girl, Mistress said with a delighted smile, her voice filled with pride. You look absolutely adorable, you've turned out even better than I imagined. Her words filled me with a sense of pride and purpose. I felt a deep sense of satisfaction knowing that I had pleased her. Thank you, mistress, I replied softly, trying to keep my voice steady. Mistress approached me, gently cupping my chin and lifting my face to meet her gaze. You are such a cute sissy girl, Jackie, she cooed. And I am going to help you become even more feminine, more seductive. You will be everything I desire and more. I nodded, feeling a mix of excitement and determination. I was ready to embrace this new identity, to become the sissy girl mistress wanted me to be. The doctor's office was just down the hall, and mistress accompanied me, her hand resting lightly on my back as we walked. The doctor greeted us warmly and led us into a private room, where the first of many hormone treatments awaited me. These treatments will help your body change, Jackie, the doctor explained as he prepared the injection. You'll start to develop more feminine features, and over time, you'll become the seductive sissy your mistress envisions. I took a deep breath as the needle pierced my skin, feeling a slight sting but also a sense of liberation. This was the beginning of my transformation, and I was ready to embrace it fully. Mistress watched with a satisfied smile, her eyes gleaming with excitement. You're doing so well, Jackie, she praised. With each treatment, you'll become more of the sissy girl you were always meant to be. Over the following weeks, the changes began to take effect. My body started to soften, my features becoming more delicate and feminine. Mistress guided me through each step, teaching me how to walk, talk, and dress like a proper sissy. She showered me with praise and affection, encouraging me every step of the way. You are becoming such a beautiful, seductive sissy, Jackie, mistress would say, her voice filled with pride. Every day, you become more perfect, more exactly what I want. I dedicated myself to fulfilling mistress's every wish, taking great pride in my role as her sissy girl. The hormone treatments continued, further feminizing my body and enhancing my features. I learned to move with grace and poise, to exude the seductive charm that mistress desired. As the months passed, I could see the transformation in the mirror. I had become a vision of femininity, a seductive sissy girl who lived to please mistress. 
Her happiness was my greatest reward, and I reveled in the knowledge that I was making her dreams come true. Jackie, my perfect sissy, mistress would whisper, her eyes filled with affection. You have become everything I ever wanted. You are truly my sweet, seductive sissy girl. Her words filled me with a deep sense of fulfillment and joy. I had embraced my true self, becoming the sissy girl I was always meant to be. And in pleasing mistress, I had found my own happiness, my own sense of purpose. I was Jackie, her sissy, and I wouldn't have it any other way.